Good morning my dear student. Yesterday we had completed till here for a few minutes and now we are going to continue the rest part of the story so everyone listen properly. Okay. Then she picked up a few more as uh, soon she had five roly poly bugs crawling on her hands and arms. Later she put them back down in the dirt. Then what she did, she picked up a few more roly-poly bugs. The bugs were crawling on her hands and arms. Later what she did, she put them back down in the dirt. Okay. That was fun. They don't bite or hurt us, she said to Grain. You see Maggie, bugs are not at all that bad, Grain said. Then Maggie said to her Grain, Grain, that was fun. The bugs, they don't bite or hurt us. Then what Grain said? Uh, you see, Maggie, bugs are not at all bad. Just then, a big bumbly bee flew past and landed in the roses near Grain. So, just then, what happened? A big bumbly bee just flew and landed in the roses near Grain. So, you know, bumbly bee. Uh, this is the image of a bumbly bee. Okay. Uh, so what they used to do? They gather uh, pollens from flowers. Okay. Grain run first. There's a bee in the roast. Maggie cried. Then Grain run faster and said, Maggie, there's a bee in the roast. Then Maggie cried. Okay. I don't need to run. The bumbly bee will not hurt me. It's gathering pollen to make honey. It knows I will not hurt it. Come closer and look at it, Grain said. Then what Grain said? Uh, I don't need to run. It will not hurt me. Um, bumbly bee were gathering pollen to make honey. And she said, I know Maggie, it will not hurt me. Come closer and look at it. Slowly, Maggie moved towards Grain. They watched the bumbly bee. Then slowly, Maggie moved towards Grain and both of them watched the bumbly bee. Okay? Look. Grain, its legs are covered with yellow stiff. What is that? She asked Grain. So, while looking, uh, Maggie asked Grain, Grain, look at its legs are covered with yellow stuff. What is that? She asked her Grain. Okay. That's the pollen, Grain explained. And then, Grain explained, that's the pollen. So, you know uh, how does um, bees take pollen from plants? Not only bumbly bee, but any insect those who take pollens. Okay. So, um, when an insect landed on a flower to feed pollen grains, sticks to its body. As uh, the insect moves to another flowers or the same species, these pollen grains are transferred to the flower stigma and pollination occurs. Okay, so that's how the insect used to take pollens from plants they watched the bee fly from one rose to another if you cut all the roses of grain how will it get pollen maggie asked so when the bees take pollen from one roses to another uh, they watched the bees okay then maggie asked to her grain uh, that grain if you cut all the roses then how will uh, bees get pollen she asked to her grain i am not cutting them all off i am leaving the ones that are still healthy and alive she said then what grain said uh, maggie i'm not cutting them all i'm leaving the ones that are still healthy and alive she said to maggie okay good i want 
the bee to have lots of pollen so that it can make honey. I like honey. Maggie smiled. After thinking for a few moments, she added, I don't think I hate bugs any more grain. They are not so bad. Caterpillars turns into pretty butterflies. Bees make honey and roly-poly bugs tickle. So uh, what Maggie say to her grain? Uh, grain, good. I want bee to have more of pollen so that it can make honey. Uh, she smiled and said, uh, I like honey. And after a few moments later, again she said, uh, Green, I don't think I hate bugs anymore. They are not so bad. And she said, Caterpillars turn into pretty butterflies and bees make honey and roly poly bugs. Uh, what they used to do? Uh, they take us, she said to her grain. Okay? But I still hate spiders said maggie green started to lurch and gave maggie a big hug and at the end what she said i still hate it spider then green lurched at her and gave her a big hug okay so children why does maggie said i hate spider it's because uh, spider are so much and more disturbing than other bugs isn't it yes so the spiders spend most of their lips hanging suspected by their legs and walk by swimming under the influence of gravity and most of the time we get to see in our homes in the corner of our room and uh, they were hanging and it's make dirty our room isn't it yes and also it look ugly so um uh, that's why she hated spider okay i hope so children you all have understood so read this story uh, i hate bugs at least five or six times to understand more okay so thank you